Welcome to the replay. Hello, hello, you guys. Hey, it's Jen with Let's Get Chalkin' with Jen, independent designer with Chalk Couture. As you guys come on, please make sure you say hello to me. I would love to welcome you. If you are catching me live, you're going to see the big red live box. Hello, Miss Stephanie. In the upper left-hand corner, that means we can chat live right here on Facebook. And if you're catching me on YouTube, you guys, please make sure you subscribe to my channel for all the fun, crafty videos. And the greatest compliment you could give me is a sprinkle. I would love it if you'd sprinkle the video, y'all. Hi. Hello, hello. Happy Thursday, you guys. How is everyone doing today? Hello again, Miss Renee. Hello, Shalyn. Oh, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Shalyn. Hello, Denise. I am 48 years old today. Yeah. Hey, I don't mind. It's all good. I'm happy. Loving life, right? What's wrong with 48? I'm 48 today. Do you send out free mini? Um, Stephanie, I actually don't send them out free. There is a little charge for the sample mini kits. But if you want to know more about that, um, just private message me what you're interested in and we can talk about that. Thank you very, very much. Happy, happy birthday. Thank you. So you guys, welcome, welcome. It is Thursday, March 4th, you guys. How exciting is that? As you come on, please say hello to me. You know what? Since today is my birthday, let's do this. In the comments, tell me what is your birthday. See. can you guys still see me nope 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 all right let me redo redo hold on we got to redo oh thank you so much you guys thank you so so much hold on somebody called so I need to um, redo the switcher it's all good we got this sorry about that I did put do not disturb on but that's okay it happens it happens Y'all, it so happens. Hello, Miss Carol. Hello, Miss Ashley. Thank you guys so much. July. Whoop, whoop. Stephanie's a July birthday. So awesome. So, you guys, all these gorgeous things that you see around me. Look at that cute little spring. Don't you love that? I'm, in, I'm totally in love with that spring. Isn't that gorgeous? These were all created using Chalk Couture products. Everything you see, except for my amazing dream catcher. Oh, another July baby. Wow, we got some Julys. March 19th, March babies. April, April. Oh, awesome. Love it, love it. So, all these gorgeous things were created using Chalk Couture products, you guys. And I am going to create something fun today just because I want to have a good time and enjoy it. So, for those of you who don't know what Chalk Couture is, hello, Ms. Donna. Real quick, we are a DIY home decor and crafting company, and you won't find our products anywhere else except through designers like myself. We have these super cool silk screen reusable transfers. Yes, Mama Johnson is a March baby. Whoop, whoop. Denise is September, love it, fall, love it, love it. We have our Chalk Couture Chalkology Chalk Paste, and we have inks, you guys. We have all the tools that you need. We have all the surfaces that you need, but this can be done on wood, glass, tin, metals, canvas, cardstock, t-shirts, dish towels, pillowcases. Oh my goodness, it goes on and on. But the greatest thing that I can offer to you is a home business opportunity. You guys, our startup kit, what, what is so amazing right now. And we are actually going to be doing the kind words. Um, what does it say? Kind words are like honey. That is the one we are going to be doing today. So hello, Tommy. Welcome. Oh, Stephanie, I'm not going to be doing ombre today. I'm so sorry. 
If you want to learn more about being a designer like myself, just put a hashtag join in the comments and I'll get you the link to join our opportunity group to watch a video. We just did an updated video today, so I would love to share that with you. All right, so let's get our project started. Let me put myself up in the corner, get that off the screen. Hello, Miss Regina. Oh, wow, Stephanie, that is awesome. In bowling and baseball, that's cool. That is so awesome. Congratulations. Hello, hello, and thank you. All right, so, <coughs> oh, wrong pipe. Here is the beauty of why I love our chalk paste, you guys. I love doing board makeovers. So, when you want to change out your designs, um, throughout the season, as long as it on is on a non-porous surface, this is the beauty of Chocotour. So I can touch it, feel it, you guys, and this is not coming off. Can you hear that? Going over it with my hand. But because this is a chalkboard surface, I'm going to go ahead and spray this with some water. Just like this. And I'm going to let that sit for a minute so that the water absorbs the chalk paste. And the reason I'm doing that is because our chalk paste is water soluble, semi-permanent. So it goes on as the liquid, it dries as the solid. And then what that means for you is anytime you want to change out your designs, you guys, you totally can do that for each and every season, for each and every holiday, as long as it is on that non-porous surface. Now, if... Sorry, I just figured I'd kill two burns with one stone while we're talking. And I'm going to go ahead and open my chalk paste while we're talking, while that's soaking. If you ever wanted to make your design permanent, hello, Miss Jane. Welcome, welcome. All you need is this Krylon sealer, and you would spray your surface, and that is going to make your design permanent, okay? So if you wanted to put this, like, on your front patio or something like that, you totally could do that. You just want to make sure you seal it. Okay, like I know a lot of people like to do their front doors, which are so, so adorable. If you had a chance to watch Chalk Fest over on the Chalk Couture home office page, you got to see someone do their front door, which was really, really cool. So I'm just getting these all open so we are ready to go. I am using our new creamy, dreamy chalk paste today, and I am obsessed with it. All right, so once the water sits in there for just a little bit, Check it out. Little bit of elbow grease and check it out. This is why I love our chalk paste. And by the way, our new creamy, dreamy chalk paste is proprietary to Chalk Couture. So the only place you are going to be able to get it is through a designer like myself. So super awesome. And look at that. Reusable. Going to clean that up over there. Okay, put it in my little tub of water. I'm gonna wipe that off because you only need one. And then I'm just gonna take a paper towel, you guys, and I'm gonna go over it like this to remove all those little crudgies. I call them crudgies. Crudgy crudgies, just like that. Then, you guys, you can still see a little bit. So I'm gonna take my board erasers, and again, we sell this, and I'm gonna go over it to get off any excess or any shadowing, just like that. I like to go over it a few times. And by the way, this is our beautiful Aiden frame. I love these chalkboards because they are a porcelain steel magnetic chalkboard. They are absolutely one of my favorites, but you can use any chalkboard you like. I just love this one and I love the frame. It's like a distressed, beautiful frame. Love, love, love it, you guys. So make sure when you come on, you're saying hello, hello to us. Let us know when your birthday is, you guys. We are celebrating birthdays today. All right, so I'm just going to dry up my chalkboard with this amazing new heat gun. Love it. Love the color. Okay. Done and done. And now I have a brand new surface I'm going to chalk on. So today... We are going to be using, and by the way, this transfer is one of the transfers that does come in your startup kit. It is also low in quantity, so get it now, get it while you can, get it while it's hot, and then it'll go out of stock, but don't worry, it does come back in stock. Mm -hmm -hmm. We are just selling them like hotcakes. And then I'm also going to be using our French Country Minis. 
and these are due to come back in stock very, very soon. So let me put this aside for one second and let's use one of our French country minis. Now you guys, like I had mentioned, oh, hello, Miss Lenora. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, that's right, it's your birthday too? No. Awesome sauce, I didn't know that. Did I say happy birthday today? If I didn't, I'm gonna be really, really sad. Happy birthday to Miss Lenora Patrick. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Miss Lenora. Happy birthday to you. I am not a singer. Please do not judge me. All right, so check this out. I see, I get carried away, you guys. These are our adorable French country minis. You guys, there are 12 of them. They are adorable. These are going to be coming back in stock very, very soon. So when they are back in stock, as long as you're in my VIP group, you will know about it. I love this transfer. It is amazing. So we are going to take one of our door tags. We do sell these as well. And we're going to do this cute little bumblebee on that one. So I'm going to take my finger, rub it over the edge, and remove my transfer from the carrier sheet. Now, that's why we write on the back, because when you are done with these, you will clean them up with water. You will wipe them down with a Clorox wipe, and then you're going to let them air dry adhesive side up. Oh, thank you, Miss Regina. Tell your godmother thank you so much. You guys, you guys make me feel so loved. Thank you. That is what I love about doing this. You guys make me feel so loved. Okay, so I'm gonna put this right on here, right? So hopefully, and then I'm gonna smooth it out so there's no air bubbles in my silk screen. Do you see that? So easy, smooth it out so there's no air bubbles. Now, this is gonna be tricky because I wanna do this in black and this in yellow. So I am gonna use my multi-purpose tools today to do this little design, okay? So I'm going to take, oh, you guys, I forgot to stir my chalk paste. Oh my goodness. Our new creamy, dreamy chalk paste is just that. It is creamy and dreamy and it is like silk. It is just gorgeous. But you always want to stir up your chalk paste because you want to get all those pigments blended together. Okay. So I'm just going to take these and stir these up for a hot second here. Hot second. Stir, stir, stir. Oh my goodness. Yes, tell me, birthdays. When is everyone's birthday that is watching? Come say hello to us. It is birthday day. 48 years old today. Whoop, whoop. I don't mind. I don't mind at all. So we are going to be using white, golden hour, black, and pistachio chalk paste. And this pistachio will be back in stock today, you guys. Is that not just the most beautiful color right there? That is gorgeous. That'll be back in stock today. All right, here we go. Taking my multi-purpose tool, dipping it in my black chalk paste, and I'm literally just gonna go around the outside edge of my transfer. Because remember, we are going to do our bumblebee in yellow in the golden hour. I hope I, I think it's golden hour. It's golden something. It's, I'm almost positive it's golden hour. Okay. Just like this, you guys. Look how easy this is. You do apply a little bit of pressure. This isn't really painting. You're applying pressure to push it through that silk screen. And that's why you use a squeegee and not a paintbrush. But this is also why I love this multi-purpose tool because it's nice and small and can get into those little bit closer areas, okay? And I might get end up getting a little bit of black into my bumblebee, but that's okay. They're always black and yellow anyway, right? Okay, just like that. And then I'm going to scrape off my excess because I need this tool again. I'll just put that in water and get my other multi-tool. No, Sandy, very rarely are you going to use water in the new paste. Very, very rarely. No, 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 because it is just too creamy, dreamy. Creamy, dreamy. And if you do add water, it's going to get too creamy, dreamy. You know what I mean? Too creamy, dreamy. That's Mama Johnson, you guys. She is amazing. We love her. 
We love her, Mama Johnson. She's the bestest in the whole world. Dear to my heart. Dear, dear, dear. And now that I know her birthday is in March, what, what? That even makes it even better. Okay, I'm gonna put this in there. And are you ready? Check it out, you guys, look. Look at that. Do you see that little bumblebee? Do you see? Oh, he's upside down, but look at it. My transfer is going to go right in water. Let me turn that around so you guys can see. Look how amazing he looks. Love him. Love you too. Love you too. Love him. Okay, so I'm going to put this aside and let that dry. And let's go to our kind words. Are like honey. Oh, yeah. I love this transfer. I cannot wait to put this behind me. Cannot wait. Okay, so on the on the um, packaging for your transfers, there are directions, you guys. So it tells you how to peel, prep, fuzz, apply, remove, heat set. That is only when you're using inks, and then clean up for future use. Because remember, I said you get anywhere from eight to ten, even more uses out of one of our transfers. Oops, do you see what I'm doing? I didn't even write on the back. So I'm just going to write on the back of this with my marker, so I know what side that goes on. You guys, I am wound up today. Wound up. So I'm going to get my fuzzing cloth because this is pretty sticky. I'm going to flip this over and I'm going to remove my carrier sheet from the transfer just like that. Now, you guys, I want to tell you this. Look at this. Do you see how sticky this is? Please, please, please make sure you fuzz your transfers before you use them when they are that sticky. The other thing I do want to mention is this. If you open your transfer and you feel like you can smell a little bit of the silk screen, take your transfer, take it off of its carrier sheet, and then just let it sit like this for a little bit. The reason I say that, just let it cure a little bit longer and then fuzz it and it shouldn't be as sticky, okay? That's just another quick little tip, and I don't know what my watch is doing, but it's being crazy. So if you ever open it and it does smell like the silk screen, take it off of its carrier sheet and let it sit with the adhesive side up and let it cure just a little bit longer, okay? I haven't had to do that in a while, but this one here is holy stickiness. Holy stickiness. Do you hear that? Oh, boy. Okay. We're going to take this and place it right where we want it on our surface and you can reposition do you see it's still really sticky you guys let me fuzz a little bit more we are gonna fuzz just a little bit more I love this transfer oh my heavens I do love it I even think this would be cute on a t-shirt super cute all right let's get this on here before I do something I shouldn't Okay, look, we've got a cute little matching bumblebee, right? How adorable is that? Then we're going to take this and smooth it out so there's no air bubbles in your silk screen. Now, if you have an air bubble, just peel it up and then place it back down. Usually what I like to do is I like to go from the inside out to make sure my surface is down. The other thing you can do is if you don't have a detail tool, you can fold down your corner so that you don't have to pick it off of the edge, okay? But I've got my cute little detail tool with my pick that I'm gonna be able to pick it right off, okay? Easy peasy breezy. Now, what am I doing? I'm gonna do this in white, this in white, these in white. I have to kind of get my plan. So let me do what I, this is what I do so I don't forget what colors I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna do this in white, this in white, I'm gonna do this in pistachio, I'm gonna do these in yellow. This is yellow, this is yellow. I'm just using a pen to write on there so I know what color I'm doing. Green, or pistachio, I'm sorry, pistachio, and white. It just helps me. So I like to do that so I don't forget what I'm doing because sometimes I can get carried away. Away, away, away. All right, so. We are going to do a little bit of chalk and peel with this because it is different colors on this transfer. 
So let me, what did I do with my paper towels? Hold on y'all, I need a little bit of paper towel here so I can clean off my multi-purpose tools over here in my water. Okay, so I need that for the pistachio in the golden hour. I'm gonna just clean them off because we need to use them. Okay, make sure I don't have any other colors on there. As you come on, you guys, please say hello to us. Let us know where you're watching from and let us know when is your birthday. Today is birthday day. All right, so I'm going to dip my multi-purpose tool in my pistachio and let's get started. Let's just get started and get chalking here, you guys. And I just got to be careful because as you can see, I don't want to get it on my flowers just like that. Do, do, do. I've got to watch what we're doing here, you guys. If you have questions, please feel free to ask your questions. When I look up, hopefully I'll see them in the comments before they go through the scroll and I will answer them. If not, I will definitely answer them on the way back. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Okay, just like this. Okay, like that. Make sure we get this on there. Scrape off your excess. All right. Put that there. Let's get this one to do our golden hour for our flowers. Just like that. Now, also, the other nice thing about the new chalk paste, you guys, is you do have a little bit more time to do a more, like, more of your surface. So keep that in mind as well. I'm not going to pull this up just yet. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit more because I'm able to do that with the new transfers. The chalk paste doesn't dry near as quick. But I just don't want my shirt going in there either. Holy cow. Not the shirt to be chalking in with my long sleeves. Oh my. So we aren't doing anything fun tonight, you guys. We're just going to chill out at home and we're going to have some cake and ice cream, just some regular cake and ice cream and just enjoy cook, cook some chicken, you know, nothing crazy today. We're going to try to do a little bit more celebrating over the weekend. So yay. Yay, yay, yay. All right. So I think I'm going to do my little, um, my little lines over here. Hello, Miss Tina. Hello, hello. In my pistachio. I like this color. This is coming back in stock today. You guys got to get that one. That is really pretty. And let me go back over that right there. Oh, that was goodness gracious. And I could probably keep going, but I'm going to go ahead and peel this up just a little bit. Oh my goodness. Like you should never peel corner to corner, but trying to hold my frame down. Do you see that? Look at that. Oh my wowzers, you guys. Look at those colors together. Oh, wait till I show you. I know you can't see the colors really well, but wow. That pistachio with that golden hour, um, gorgeous. Just dry this a little bit. Look how simple and easy it is to create beautiful home decor. And no joke can change it for each and every season. Right? Love it. Okay. Now I'm just going to take this. This is what we call chalk and peel. And I'm just going to place it back down. I'm not pressing it. Just placing it back down. Okay? Then I'm, I'm going to actually finish the rest of the sign. There's no reason I shouldn't be able to get it done. So we're going to take a, another mini squeegee. Use our golden hour to do our honey because honey is that color. Honey, honey, honey. Love it, love it. Here we go. Applying pressure, holding your squeegee at that 90 degree angle. Like I said, this isn't, you don't want to be like gentle and easy. You want to press it, scrape it across that silk screen area. Get your excess off. Look at that little Bumblebee. Oh, is he just the sweetest? Here we go, you guys. Look at this. Just like that. We are almost done. 
let's do our white like this and then we're going to do the pistachio in the middle and we will be done we just need to add our little embellishment and wait till you see how cute this looks now like i had mentioned earlier you guys i do have a private vip group where i share all things happening in chocotour um, you can also learn about becoming a designer or a club couture member in there as well so as long as you are not a designer i would love to welcome you in our vip group just put a hashtag vip in the comments and i will get you the link to join us in there we would love to welcome you it is an amazing group of women we share ideas and inspiration we have fun and we love new people joining us so just put that hashtag vip all right ready here we go get the rest of this off and I actually have a tiny little boo-boo that I can get right off of there okay go easy with your transfer when it's sticky like this do you see what I'm doing go side to side when it's sticky like that okay even though I fuzz it it's still a little sticky just rock it back and forth side to side put your transfer in your water okay now real quick you guys don't leave your transfers in your water overnight when you're done, I like to tell people, rule of thumb, when you're done, try to get over and clean your transfers and get them all out of the water because they are like a water-based a water -based transfer and you don't want it to lose its stickiness, okay? So after it's in the water and you get done doing your design, make sure you take it over and get it cleaned off and get it to let it air dry, okay? So keep that in mind. Do you see that? I didn't even need my tool. Look how gorgeous that looks together. Do you guys not love that? Look at that. Look at that. Nice, crisp lines. But this is what I wanted to show you. Do you see this little thing right here? It's like a little extra dot there. I'm going to take my detail tool, you guys. Do you see this? How amazing this detail tool is. Look at that. Boom. It's gone. It is gone. I love this detail tool. If you don't have one, get one. I love the detail tool. Just for those tiny little mistakes like that. Okay? Look at that. That little dot is now gone. That is why I love it. Okay? So, here we go. Let's get this dry. Let's use our new, new heat tool and get this dry. Dry it up a little bit, dry it up. I hope you guys are loving this beautiful design. And remember, this is one of the transfers that come in the startup kit. Our startup kit is $99 in the US or $120 or $127 in Canada. And like I said, I do have a opportunity group where I just did a live presentation today all about it. If you want to learn more, just put that hashtag join in the comments and I will get you that link. No obligation, you guys. None. Just create beautiful, high-end DIY home decor. So let's get this all dried before we keep going. I cannot wait to display this. Oh my gosh. This would be cute anywhere. Kitchen, dining room, living room, game room, entryway, front porch, patio, you guys, this design could go just about anywhere. And I, again, think it would be great on a t-shirt. I think it would be awesome on a t-shirt. Okay, so, now let me make some room over here. Put my scissors away. Let's get all these put away because I just need a little tiny bit of space here. Okay. Put this one up here. I'm trying not to get my shirt in the water. Oh, actually, I needed that. All right, so I'm going to take some twine just like this and I'm totally going to just wrap it around the top. Nothing fancy, you guys. Totally nothing fancy. I'm going to stick it through there. And actually, let me let me stick them both through there. I just don't want to use tape. I don't feel like doing it with tape. Okay. 
so I need to go just like this. And then let's tie this as tight as we can. Move it up just a little bit. Tie knot. I'm going to tie an extra knot in this one so that it doesn't pull through. Cut off my excess. I'm going to get myself. Where is another one? I'm going to get myself some little beads. You guys can buy these beads at your local Walmart. And actually, I need to get a tiny little bit of tape. So when I have to put, um, I said, um, when I have to put my ends through a little hole, you guys, I like to use just a little bit of tape on the ends because it's easier to push through and grab it on the other side. Okay. So we're just going to push this through and actually hold on, hold on, you guys, hold on. This hole in this one is almost shut. There we go. Okay. So see, it allows me to push it through and it's easier to grab on the other side. Okay. That's why I like to use tape. And that's why I try to make my um, string or rope extra long for that reason. Okay. So like that, and then watch, I'll be able to just cut it right off. Just like that. Let's do the other side. You just twist it around, just like that. This one has a bigger opening, so we should be good on this one, but. Sorry, y'all, sorry, sorry, we are almost done. Almost done, there we go. I hope you love this design today. Happy, happy March 4th, y'all. Happy March 4th. Look at that. And now you have this cute little sign. You could play with that. Just like that. That you could put right on. I'm going to actually put it right over here in place of my hello. But look how gorgeous that is, you guys. Look how cute and simple and elegant that is right? Do you not love it? I love it. I love the colors for spring. I think it'll flow great into summer. I need to make this just a tiny bit tighter, but you guys, isn't that adorable? Kind words are like honey, sweet to the soul. This is our Aiden board, the nine by 12. This is one of our door tags that come in a pack of six. I used our white pistachio, golden hour, and black chalk paste today. A little bit of twine, a little bit of beads, and you've got a beautiful design, you guys. All right. I hope you loved today's presentation. If you have any questions, please let me know. You are always welcome. Yay! Sandy loved it. Yay! You are always welcome to check everything out right on my website at chalkingwithjen.com. And anything you need, please let me know. And I'll be chalking with you later, you guys. I got to go get ready for some cake soon. All right. Bye.